Hi there, it's Claire here from The Wellness Project. Thank you so much for tuning in. This is my first vlog for 2014 and I'm really, really excited to share this with you. So here I am, I'm on holidays in Jarvis Bay and I brought my camera with me and I didn't think I'd be doing anything with this camera until today, my last day here. I've just come off the beach and I had an idea of something that I really want to share with you. So I've been doing a lot of work over the last month on desire mapping, so coming up with my own core desire feelings for 2014. And today, as I was journaling, I was writing out those core desires and trying to come up with what I wanted to create this year that directly fed from those core design feelings. And what I realized is I actually need to come out of it from a more shadow perspective. I actually need to move through 2014 thinking about the darker side, which is what do I not want to feel in 2014? So what I ended up doing is on a clean sheet of paper, at the very top, I wrote what 2014 is not about. And this is an exercise that I think that you'll really, really enjoy. So I started to just chuck down words and phrases and ideas as to what 2014 isn't going to be for me and what I'm putting out to the universe that I'm saying no to. So fear, insecurity, self-doubt, comparison any of those emotions or any specific experiences from previous year or previous years that I've choosing this year to let go of, to completely surrender and say, no, nope, I'm not having that this year. So I just wanted to share that with you because I'm doing that today. I'm sitting here writing down all these ideas and thinking, this shadow work is really powerful. You know, we spend all this time focusing on the positive and trying to build ourselves up with the beautiful, amazing, inspirational words, which is such a powerful practice and it's so important, but it's also important to pay attention to the darker side stuff as well. So what don't you want? What is it that you would like to be free of this year? What is it that when you think of it makes you feel contracted and constricted? What are the experiences and emotions that are holding you back from moving forward into the rest of your life? So off the back of this, I also just want to flag for you guys that the Freedom Project, my online e-course that dives into ego and into manifestation and creation, is actually starting again soon in early Feb. So enrollments for this course are opening up in mid-Jan. So I invite you to check out the website, which is thefreedomproject.net.au and make sure you check in there really soon because I'll be opening up enrollments and you'll be able to get involved as soon as possible. Now, if any of the testimonials you can see on that website are to go by, you'll know that this is a hugely transformative experience and one that completely fills my life with so much joy and happiness. So, if learning how to let go of the stuff that you don't want is for you this year, then I definitely say the Freedom Project might be knocking on your door. So, other than that, I invite you to give this exercise a go and I would love to hear from you and love to hear what you think of this exercise and what's come up for you in this exercise. So what don't you desire for 2014? And let's make sure we are completely clear about all of that and letting them go. All right, so much love to you and I'll see you back in Sydney soon. Bye.